Colorado is a very windy place. Monday was the sixth time since September there was potentially damaging high winds of at least 84 miles per hour. But believe it or not, it used to be even windier, especially with damaging high wind events on the front range. Those actually seem to be getting less frequent over the last 30 years. And also the overall magnitude of the events we get are decreasing as well. National Weather Service meteorologist Paul Schlotter is a Colorado native and he now issues high wind warnings in his home state. He pulled the high wind data across the Front Range over the last 28 years and found a declining trend in high wind events. From 1996 to 2005, all 10 years had at least 10 days with an 84 mile per hour wind gust. Over the last 19 years, there's only been one year with that many high wind days, and that was back in 2011. He says that decrease in high winds might not be noticeable to the average resident, but it's significant enough for the National Center for Atmospheric Research to launch an investigation. They are looking at this very topic, uh, trying to explain why there's a 28 year declining trend in the intensity and number of these events that are occurring. Um, and they're trying to trying to see if climate change might play a role in that. Um, but so far, research hasn't really come up with any answers to that question yet. Meteorologist Corey Reppenhagen, 9 News.